Hey guys, this is Jamin bringing you another key replacement video today. Working on an Acer Aspire V5 series computer. We're going to be showing you in this video how to take off a normal size key, a letter key, uh, how to take it off safely and then how to reinstall it um, in the event that you lose a key or it breaks. Uh, oftentimes you can't find replacements for these online. Sometimes you can. It's, it's worth taking a look. Uh, but oftentimes you can't. You'll end up having to buy a used keyboard. Uh, and then taking the key off of that uh, But the benefit there is you have some spares if you need them So we'll show you how to take one off. We'll show you how to put it back on uh, If you want to know how to do a larger key like the space key or the enter key uh, Check out the link below that'll be in a different video. Uh, this video is just for the normal size keys So we're going to zoom in uh, We're going to zoom in right here And show you how to go after one of these keys. So you're going to need a small flathead screwdriver, smaller the better. Uh, the larger it is, the more chance you have of breaking something. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to try to get the, the uh, screwdriver underneath my key cap, uh, but on top of the retainer clip underneath, which you can't see. Uh, so I'm going to take this off and then show you what we're dealing with underneath. So I'm going to put it underneath. I'm going to go slow, feel it out. There we go. Pop that up. Comes up pretty easily. And as you see there, my screwdriver is holding down that white clip, which is what I wanted to do. If you just grab one of these caps and, and rip it off, uh, this retainer clip is made out of very flimsy, very thin plastic, and, and there's a good chance you'll break it. Uh, so that's how you would take it off. Um, watch out for this little rubber thing here. That, that's easy to gouge up and rip that up, and you definitely don't want to do that. It's just held on by glue. So these are just notoriously difficult to get back on once they've been ripped up. Now in order to take this clip up, a lot of these clips are, are, are laid out in one of two ways on these computers. Either there'll be two metal pins toward the top corners and two metal pins toward the bottom. Or in this case, you see there's two metal pins toward the top and then one clip toward the bottom. So in order to get this out, uh, it, it's kind of tight. But in order to get this out, I'm, I'm going to push up on it as much as I can. I'm going to try to uh, slowly pry out the plastic from under these metal clips on top. So this is the dangerous part. This is where you'll break it. Uh, so I'll, I'll show you how to take it up and then I'll, get, I'll give you a zoom in picture of this clip to show you what we were dealing with. So there's one side, there's the other side. Okay. I didn't break it, so we're good. So I'll move that over here and now I'll zoom in and show you what that looked like. So the reason why this is so flimsy and so easy to break, if you notice on each side you'll see uh, here and here, these two little tiny, tiny plastic pins that come out, those are all that was holding this down underneath those two metal pins. So that's very easy to break. That's why you have to push up as much as you can and gently pry those out because that's definitely where you'll break this. So that's how you get it out. To put it back in, we're just going to go in reverse. We're going to lay it down bottom first, get that bottom part right here underneath that bottom pin. Get this thing lined up. And, th and this may take you a few extra tries. Uh, I, I do this a lot, but when I started doing this, I broke so many of these things. Uh, so just go slow, be patient. That's in there. It looks lined up. Now I'm just going to push on, on the corners and those should just snap right in. Just like that. And then you get your key on, your key cap, you center it and you push. And that just slides right, right back on like that. So that's how you would install, or that's how you would uh, salvage a key off of a keyboard. And then install it back on. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Uh, if you get stuck or if it doesn't look quite the same in your model, uh, leave us a comment. We'll get back to you at least a couple times a day. Uh, please like and share if this was helpful. Thank you so much for watching.